If love has these conditions, I don't understand those songs you love. This is not a love song. This is not fantasy land. This is a real life exploration of the dramatic rush song, Cold Fire. Fire. Well, Fire. gentlemen, I'm under the understanding that you have some hot sports opinions about this song. I do, but I've, I've got a question first. Okay. Yes. Start with the question. I need to know because I'm sure one of y'all has already got them up, but to look up the lyrics, it's, and it's because of something I read today and the lyrics were posted, but I don't think that's what the lyric says. I don't think he says this and it's in the first line. Okay. It was just after midnight. It was long after midnight. It was long after midnight when we got to unconditional. Right. Yeah. Love. Unconditional. Unconditional love. Yes. Okay. Play that. I don't hear him say the word love. I hear him say, it was long after midnight when we got to unconditional. Uh, Really? Yeah. I don't hear that. Okay. I've never heard it. Hmm. When we got to unconditional love. Yeah, unconditional love. Unconditional loved him. He did not say love. Yeah, he did. He goes, he when we to... got to unconditional love. No. Yeah, he did. It's unconditional. He said unconditional love all like No, one he does sentence. not. Play it again, Sam. I just exited. Oh. He's going to have to listen to it because it's there. It is absolutely Jay, there. Jay, can we agree I, to disagree agree. with him? We agree to disagree <laughs> with him. Look, I'm going to say this. I've listened to this song a thousand times more than you guys. Mm-hmm. Mm, okay. Not very closely. Apparently. apparently not. Apparently he doesn't even know who this band See? is. It's called Rush. <laughs> Yeah, you, you might have noticed. Jay and I are fans. Yeah. Him. This is every Rush song, not every... I do not hear doing. I do not hear the word love. I hear Maybe you're just blind. Well, he doesn't separate unconditional and love. What he says, when we got to unconditional love, it's one, it sounds like one word. So you, I can hear why you might, I can see where you might not have heard love, but unconditional you might well you might say unconditional i can hear you can might say that but you're wrong he yeah, sings yeah. unconditional you love i said rough <laughs> all we need is rough my dog's singing <laughs> but at the same time reading the same lyrics coming right up after that i always thought it was this is not a love song this is a fantasy land. But then when uh, I saw the lyrics saying, this isn't fantasy land. Actually, that, I thought, number I, one, I, that makes more sense. But then I when thought, I listened to it, I could hear this isn't, I, I could hear the ink in that. Yeah, but I was the same way. I and it makes, it it makes more land. sense that way. Okay. It does. He, yeah, he makes more sense. Yeah. I is mean, that your hot sports opinion, Tim? That you can't you can't hear love? Is that are those your strong no, thoughts on no. this one? That My sounds like a deeper <laughs> issue to me. I mean, yes. Tim I'm, can't hear love. Tim I'm can't no hear for some reason. Yeah. I mean, Jay and I, Jay and I can distinctly hear him say, but for some reason, yeah, Tim yeah. can't hear him. I mean, you know, Jay, do you, I, th- I, I do you hear him funny. say? Yeah, yeah. I, 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 think, I totally hear him say, yeah. I think it's funny He's that saying, in the hundred quadrillion thousand episodes that we've done, and anytime uh-huh. we've wanted to hear something, oh yeah, Shane could play it. But now, because all you need he is he knows I'm right, he doesn't want to play it, saying, "Oh, well, I can't right now." You're just gonna have to listen to it on your own. No, 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 no. <laughs> No, no, I don't buy that for a minute. What I was going to say is, doesn't it seem like what he's talking about in this song, that the roles are stereotypically reversed? Yes. Because it's 
it's the woman who's saying, you know, don't disappoint me, you know, um, don't let me down. When usually that would be the guy's, the man's stance on the relationship. Hey, woman, don't disappoint me. I'll drop you like a. I feel like I feel like the woman is dropped. I feel like the woman's saying, hey, you got a good thing. We got a good thing going here. Don't be, you know, don't be an idiot. Don't be a guy. Don't disappoint me. Don't be stupid. Don't Don't be be stupid. stupid. Don't be stupid. Is there a little bit of, hey, stop creeping me out? Yeah. Maybe. Yeah. (laughs) You're you're getting creepy now. We just met. Don't play the love songs. Yeah. Unconditional love. What are you talking about? Slow down, eh? Love is a minty, I, a mini fresh. <laughs> what? I like when I heard, I was like, love is a mini splintered thing. I think, uh, I, and what I got out of basically all of this is love is work. It's a careful balance between passion and mutual respect. Uh, it's not a fairy tale story, true story. With ups and downs, give and takes, ins and outs, <laughs> giggle, uh, and it's you know it's it it's work. It's it's not just it's not it's not a fantasy land. It's not it's not a Hallmark movie. Love is right. Love is not uh, love is not to be fooled with. But to be don't trifle. Not one well, it sound, it, well, it sounds to me like she's not really wanting to uh, work at it all that hard. It's just don't disappoint me. You know, I I'll think be she's... around if you don't let me down. Well, if you let her down that one time, like you ordered pizza and you got pepperoni and mushroom, but she wanted pepperoni and onion. Did you let her down? Is relationship over with? Right now. They start getting into a heated good, argument, really. which turns into a cold fire. I've never had pepperoni and onion, though. I've had pepperoni and like jalapeno. That's one of my favorites. Now, what? I did like, I do like this part. Yeah, me too. And I'm not ashamed to admit, I've seen this look before. The look in her eyes as she heads for the door. <laughs> that's it's cold and, but fire. see right to me that's where i've had it and i'm walking out and it's the look right before she opens the door to walk out she just looks back at you and is just burning holes right through your stomach i think basically anybody no 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 i get <laughs> like i i think basically she's saying hey hey don't be stupid and like talk just <laughs> just don't ruin the moment stop explaining everything stop i don't need explaining. to explain everything just 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 don't mansplain me mother man oops are we are we explicit because i feel like i might uh, have I, I broken put mad. the e on there Roll. because you two oh youtube not, not bono and edge but you you two you two yeah. yeah i love bono and edge though see i think Neil's ex- he's portraying a guy who's expecting more out of the relationship than the girl is. And now he's complaining to his friends about it. And they're probably drinking beer in a garage on a Thursday night. See what I did there? Oh, beer Thursday. Yeah. And I, I think the communication is high. The miscommunication is highlighted in the chorus. <laughs> Not a placement there. Cause if you listen, there's two distinct vocals on the, I'll be around if you don't let me down too far. And I think, Part of that is the guy complaining to his friends about what she said while he's still hearing her voice echo in his head. Yeah, that's good. I like yeah, that. Yeah. I also think that I probably should have mentioned that last week when we were doing the music. I think I'm going to pull it up and play it so you can hear it. But I also oh, think oh, 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 oh. <laughs> I don't think what she said is as bad as how he took it. I think he takes it wrong. I think he's he's found someone who's confident, mature, and intelligent enough to set boundaries, but he's pissed because she didn't say what he wanted to hear. All right. 
because See, he I think he's a, re- he spent a lot of time listening to her or observing her listen to all of her love songs. And he's thinking, oh, man, okay. This Did that ever great. happen to you? Did you ever do that? Did you go ever try to sweep a girl off her feet and do all the stuff from the movies and the and the romantic novels and all that? And just to be shunned and wonder, hey, I did all the right stuff. Why doesn't she love me? Did that ever happen to you? Oh, yeah. No. <laughs> it didn't happen no. to Tim. I didn't, forgot it didn't happen to Tim. <laughs> forgot well, who we're dealing no. with here. What are you talking yeah. about? <laughs> Back when I was single, my problem was falling for girls that didn't want you to be like that. They preferred the guy that was the, the a-hole, you know, and that just wasn't me. Wait, a lot of times those things that the heroes or the, the, the romantic guys, whatever the dude, the, the billionaire, the eccentric billionaires yeah. do in those books and movies works for the book or for the movie. But when someone does it in real life, it's, it's kind of creepy. Kind of scary. It, right. Yeah. It's a little much. It's a little much. Yeah. I can. Yeah. Yeah. Like, uh, never I, 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 I will tell you this. This is funny. It was so when my wife and I were before we were, we were, da- we were dating, but I, there's a song, uh, called, uh, uh, she's always a woman by Billy Joel. And I, Again, now we were, we just started dating and I play this song for her and I like, this song makes me think of you. And it's like, it's like a really, you know, deep love saying, kill us. She's always a woman with me. Blah, blah. And they don't ever say anything like that. Oh, wait, no, it wasn't always a woman. <laughs> I think it's no, it's I'm, not, I'm so apologist. It was uh she's got a way about her. She's got a way about uh-huh. her. Uh-huh. I I know, but I, you know, I don't know what it is, but I, I can't live without her. You know, we had just started dating and I'm like, this song reminds me of you. And like, oh yeah, that, that, that could, that could have ended everything right there because that's pretty creepy for me to throw that out there right or so early. But you know, that's why men have to learn, you know, don't, you gotta pull that back a little bit. Don't. Yeah. He's Don't up there. Uh, slow down, cowboy. Yeah, slow down, cowboy. Yeah, ease up, man. Ease up. No, Easy that's boy. why. That's why with every girl I ever dated, and with the girl that I dated and then married, the first song that I played for them, painkiller. You know, when we were alone, um, just kind of number one down. to set to set the mood and to get my point across was you got another thing coming. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, yes. Nice, Tim. So, That's such nice. a romantic. Followed by God of Thunder. Uh huh. And, and, and then, and of course, Doctor Love. Yes. <laughs> no, no, no. Because then, after I did that, then I turned to Rush. But I was by myself, and I was playing Tears over and over. <laughs> uh, what would touch you deeper? Oh yeah, I th- I think something I had in my notes that I forgot to mention is when it. Yeah, when it comes to stuff like that, just young 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 men and women out there dating know the difference between a fantasy and a desire. Like something in a book might be great for the book, but come across creepy in real life. So it's Slow just down, eh? a fantasy. It's not the real thing. Favorite lyrics. It's just a fantasy. It's just a fantasy. Favorite lyrics, Jay. My favorite lyrics are the the line uh, where it starts to go argumentative. I liked right before leading up to that. It was just before sunrise when we started on traditional roles, the traditional <laughs> roles. Uh, she said, sure, I'll be your partner, but don't make uh, too many demands. I said, if love has these conditions, I don't understand those songs you love. She said, this is not a love song. This isn't a fantasy. I love that. That's great. And like, yeah, goes right into that argument. Yeah. Tim, do you have any favorite lyrics? I bet I know what Tim's favorite lyrics is. What's your favorite lyrics, Tim? When we got to unconditional. 
Oh, unconditional. Yeah. Yeah. No. My favorite lyrics are <laughs> pattern of the moonlight on the bedroom floor. So you've just made sweet. That is a, love. That's pretty. Yeah. Yeah. You got yeah. the curtains open. Talk slower. Full moon out. Oh. And the moonlight shining <laughs> in. And you're just, you know it's, what? That was okay. <laughs> But but no, it's the um, the look in the look in her eyes, uh, or the look in your eyes as you head for the door. Yo, yeah, that just uh, that that one right there is like, oh yes, kind of resonated. Yeah, yeah. I didn't think Canadians could feel that way. That, that's cold fire. Cold I think fire. Cold fire. fire. I really like that whole sequence there. I guess that's the, is that the chorus? I don't know what, I don't know the song parts. They always do. They've done that a lot where is that the verse, the chorus? I don't know which is which. I would say that's more of a, maybe a bridge. Maybe. Maybe. But, or a bridge. Yeah, I, I, would, I, yeah I, I would, cause I would, I would think that the chorus is I'll be around. Right. I'll be around. Yeah. Okay. That makes sense. Yeah. But that kind of tells a story right there, right? Phosphorescent wave on a tropical sea. There's the the spark, the thing that gets your attention, a pattern of moonlight on the bedroom floor. That's the uh, the consummation, the if you will. The act, that, <laughs> the flame at the heart of the palm broker's diamond is a cold. Let's flag. get married, that, baby. That's where the guy proposed too soon, moved too fast, and then she's like, "Whoa, back off!" So he's like, "Okay, there's some there's some good and some bad in this situation here." Or and or then maybe, the look maybe. in your eyes as you head to the door, the end. Maybe he broke the spell. May, may, maybe it's not that he presented her with an engagement ring. Maybe it's her taking the wedding ring off and hawking it. <laughs> she hawked the ring. Ooh. Now that's oh, a cold that's fire. Good. That's yeah. a cold fire. But you know what? That's wow. a really good point. Especially because when when he gave it to her, she told him that she absolutely that ring. Yeah. Right. Right. And yeah. It was an unconditional. I mean, for sure. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> Not only are those brilliant poetically the phosphorescent wave on a tropical sea what pattern of moonlight on the bedroom floor because it it seems really good but looking back on it and like at the time it's great but then looking back on it 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 burns like like cold burn sometimes it did and i'd have to go get a shot Okay. So thanks uh, I, again for <laughs> any other favorite lyrics from Cold Fire, Jay? <laughs> but I love myself. Obviously. I love you too, Jim. <laughs> <laughs> I win him. You know, um, I really do, and you pointed out, Tim. That's a really good point. the The flame at the heart of a pawnbroker's diamond. I took that to mean that he went and bought a ring. You, but <laughs> what really happens here sounds like maybe she's like, "Oh, yeah, I'm not good. Yeah, no, let me yeah. sell this ring. Where you're I'll moving take it. too fast, Buster. Yeah, exactly." I don't think the girl in this song, I don't think she'd take it. I think he's pawning it because he got turned down. That's what I think. Ah, that's a good point, too. You know what? I don't even really know this song. Who is we this? <laughs> is it possible we're reading too much into the story? It's always no. possible and usually the case. It's <laughs> never, right. you can never I mean, read too much into a song, especially Neil's. I, I actually think no. he's talking about a. A midwinter's campfire. He was. They were out camping. Him, Getty, and Alex. And it's middle of winter up in Canada. 
They've got mm-hmm. a fire going, but it's Canada, so it's so freaking cold. It's cold as they ice. Had a cold fire. Wrong band. Right. Wrong band. Hmm. No, I mean it's um, it's it's so cold. It's it is cold as ice. And ice, uh, the slang for uh, ice for diamonds is is ice. So when you think about it, you analyze it, uh, and you put it all together. You kind of slap it around a little bit, put some paint on it. Uh, you really think of <laughs> yeah, this isn't a spoiler or anything, but cold fires huh? mentioned a lot in Clockwork Angels. Really? Yeah, cold fire is uh, uh, this power source that the watchmaker uses to make things. See? Yeah. Coincidence? Uh-huh. But but the whole book is full of. I references. think not. Yeah. No. 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 Well, you got you should read Clockwork Angels. You guys, I'm telling you, you would probably not no, it. Okay, number one. I did. <laughs> I'd rather just watch the movie. Is it in the right? Movie? When's yeah. the movie coming out? Yeah. I hey, when's the movie come out? It'd be a great movie. They should see they, they should I totally think, do. I think this like this song, if they could put the song in the Clockwork Angels movie, since so yeah. it talks about cold fire so much, I think Matthew McConaughey would play this part great. Yeah. I'm just saying, Matthew, I think you'd do a good job. Maybe just the watchmaker all right, all right, or the all right. The watchmaker no, the, or Elwin. No, no, I think this would be boy. a perfect movie the for hero. like someone like uh I don't know, Malcolm McDowell to be in. Like, you know, like, but younger, you know, like a, like a younger version of him from the (laughs) seventies. Let's, let's do that, Jay. Let's make that happen. Let's make that happen. Well, that's what we think about the lyrics and the meaning of cold fire. We want to know what you think about it. Email us 2112 at everyrushsong.com catch us on the soch at every rush song tim take us home thank you very kindly kansas city good night